So here are some more homeopathic natural medicines to help your body fight the symptoms of Ebola like internal bleedings, thus giving your mind and organs the information to stop the Ebola hemorrhage through various snake venoms as Vipera berus C30 or C200 as some snake poisons also cause serious hemorrhage and if the bleeding can be stopped you stand a much better chance of survival the virus will still be there but so what? <laughs> It's not the virus killing you, but the various symptoms do. And this homeopathy makes your body fight the symptoms, but not the virus. Snake venoms come in all forms. Some will lame your respiratory systems, some are nerve agents, and some cause internal bleeding, similar to Ebola. And taken in combination with the flu pills shown in my other video, at least your body's immune system will be activated to a full extent ready to fight the buggers instead of participating in a lame duck shoot. This is a way to avoid the scary possibility of that mandatory vaccination by those lying pharaonic authorities with their Mason Georgia Guidestone plans with that injection waiting for you, killing the virus and your butt with it, eliminating host and patient. So you can read it all if you read German. Well, I mean, this is Latin anyway here. Uh, the 1918 Influenza Hispanica will be very hard to find, but the, uh, the rest you can find. So, good luck everyone. And I wouldn't like to lose any of your subscribers, would I now? <laughs> okay. So, and here's that other video on my same uh, channel about the flu killer. Uh, homeopathic uh, uh, in combination with the snake venoms and the various other ones I just showed you which you can try to make and purchase um, it will be hard though to get the 1918 Spanish influenza in them but in, in combination with the uh, the snake venoms your body will be uh, at least be prepared you know to uh, to stand the fight they're gonna pick on you and the org and your organism with their Georgia Guidestone thing, Ebola or whatever, and the mandatory vaccination, which will kill the patient and the vi the virus and the patient. Okay, good luck to you all.